Today's story is Who is at the Zoo by Sharon J. Boyce. I walk into my bathroom and much to my surprise, there's a tiger on the toilet and a hippo in the tub. She's using, using all our jasmine soap to give herself a scrub. There's a monkey doing hairstyles on a lion's luscious mane and a lemur with my toothbrush spitting toothpaste down the drain. Then I find there's a zebra in the kitchen who's frying up some eggs and a warthog's eating bacon while my dog jumps up and begs. A leopard's watching television, yelling at the screen, and a peek inside the laundry shows a bear at the machine. I'm feeling quite bewildered, and I haven't got a clue. If these animals are in my house, then who is at the zoo? I step outside and see a possum in the garden bed is pulling out the weeds, a walnut hose in nice neat rows, a rabbit drops in seeds. A deer is walking up and down while pushing on the mower. A dingo cleans the gutters using dad's electric blower. Across at Mrs. Simpson's house, a penguin paints the door. A team of busy otters lay new carpet on her floor. Just as I think this day cannot get any more bizarre, I see a squirrel zooming past in Mr. Brown's new car. I'm confused and in a muddle, and I'm sure that you are too. If these animals are in my street, then who is at the zoo? And next I discover, at my school, the crossing lady is a giant tortoise. The teacher giving swimming lessons is a friendly porpoise. The senior choir is singing loud, conducted by a moose, and it looks as though the principal is now a honking goose. An emu on the oval leads the soccer team through drills. As I watch them running back and forth, I see they've learnt new skills. I know that I should stay in school and concentrate on classes, but then I see my teacher is a python wearing glasses. My brain is twirling in a loop. I'm puzzled through and through. If these animals are at my school, then who is at the zoo? In town, I see the baker is a rhino selling loaves of fresh warm bread. It's not the postman on his bike, but a croc instead. In the market is the meerkat, who is very busy shopping. While over at the timber yard, giraffes do all the ch chopping. There's a mongoose at the library desk checking out a book, and my favorite little cafe has a panda as, at its, as its cook. A fire truck is whizzing past, a reindeer at the wheel. The lifeguard watching at the beach is a giant seal. Although my mind is boggled, I'm curious now too. It's time I go and figure out just who is at the zoo. I hurry through the city, dodging cheetahs wearing skates. I see the zoo just up ahead and enter through the gates. I hope I'll get my answer, cause I haven't got a clue. I truly am befuddled as to who is at the zoo. I wander up and down the paths. I look at all the cages. I laugh until my belly aches. I'm entertained for ages. I have the best day ever. What a hullabaloo. Now I know without a doubt 
who is at the zoo? And who do you think is at the zoo? No. <gasps> Please don't feed the grown-ups. Looks like we found out who is at the zoo. The end.